How to Start a Business Step-by-Step -step Guide Starting a business can be an exciting and rewarding experience, but it can also be challenging. To give yourself the best chance of success, it's important to have a solid plan in place. In this article, we'll take you through the steps you need to follow to start a business, from coming up with a business idea to launching your company. Step 1, Identify a Need or Opportunity The first step in starting a business is to identify a need or opportunity in the market. This could be a product or service that's missing, or something that could be improved upon. Look at what's currently available and think about how you could offer something better or different. Identifying a need or opportunity involves recognizing a gap in the market that your product or service could fill. It requires research and analysis to understand what customers want and what competitors are offering. By addressing a need or opportunity, you can create a unique value proposition and differentiate yourself in the marketplace. Step 2. Research your market. Once you have an idea for your business, it's important to research your market. This will help you determine if there is a demand for your product or service, who your competitors are, and what your target audience is. One way to research your market is to conduct a survey or focus group. This will give you insights into what your potential customers are looking for and what they're willing to pay for it. Researching your market involves gathering information about your potential customers, competitors, and industry trends. This can be done through surveys, focus groups, and online research. Understanding your market will help you identify opportunities, determine pricing strategies, and develop effective marketing campaigns to reach your target audience. Step 3. Write a business plan. A business plan is a comprehensive document that serves as a blueprint for a company's operations, growth, and success. It typically includes several sections, each of which provides specific information about different aspects of the business. The first section of a business plan is the executive summary. This provides an overview of the business, including its mission statement, target market, and unique value proposition. It should also include the company's financial goals and projections. The company description section provides a detailed overview of the business, including its history, ownership structure, and legal status. It should also include information about the industry in which the business operates, as well as any relevant market trends or challenges. The market analysis section should provide information about the company's target market, including demographic information, market size, and key competitors. This section should also outline the company's marketing and sales strategies. Your business plan should include Executive Summary Company Description Market Analysis Product or Service Description Marketing and Sales Strategies Financial Projections Management Team Step 4 Determine your business structure. Before you can register your business, you need to decide on a business structure. This will depend on the type of business you're starting, the number of owners, and the level of personal liability you're comfortable with. Choosing the right business structure is a critical step in starting a business. It determines the level of control you have over the company, how you pay taxes, and how much personal liability you have. Common business structures include sole proprietorship, partnership, LLC, and corporation, each with their own advantages and disadvantages. Common business structures include Sole proprietorship Partnership Limited liability company, LLC Corporation Step 5. Register your business Once you've determined your business structure, you need to register your business with the appropriate government agencies. This typically involves obtaining a business license and registering for taxes. Registering your business involves completing the necessary legal and administrative tasks to establish your company as a legal entity. This typically includes registering with the appropriate government agencies, obtaining business licenses and permits, and obtaining tax identification numbers. By registering your business, you can protect your personal assets, establish credibility with customers and vendors, and comply with legal requirements. Step 6. Secure Funding 
Starting a business can be expensive, so it's important to have a plan for funding your venture. This could include Bootstrapping, funding your business with your own savings and revenue. Small business loans, borrowing money from a bank or other lender. Crowdfunding, raising funds from a large number of people through online platforms. Venture capital, obtaining funding from investors in exchange for equity in your company. Step 7, choose a location and set up your business. Depending on the type of business you're starting, you may need to find a physical location and set up your operations. This could include leasing office space, purchasing equipment, and hiring employees. Step 8, develop your brand and marketing strategy. To attract customers, you need to develop a strong brand and marketing strategy. This could include creating a logo, developing a website, and advertising your business through social media and other channels. Step 9, launch your business. Once you've completed all of the above steps, it's time to launch your business. This could involve hosting a launch event, sending out a press release, or simply opening your doors for business. Starting a business can be a long and challenging process, but with the right plan in place, you can set yourself up for success. By following these steps, you'll be well on your way to launching a successful and profitable business.